This year's emerging leader is passionate about youth and spending quality time outdoors. They demonstrate it every day through their outdoor work with children in our community by showing compassion to kids needing safety net in their lives. When COVID hit our communities, this person sought ways to help preserve the outdoor opportunities. When faced with summer 2020 COVID regulations where group activities were ordered to be canceled, this leader was determined to find alternative ways for children in the community to get out of their homes. He worked with staff to develop a modified day camp, which was offered throughout the summer of 2020. When it was time for kids to return to school, but only online at that time, day camp extended into the fall so parents would have the option of somewhere for their children to go to work on their schoolwork, but also to get out and enjoy the outdoors. Within his five-year tenure, he had led the organization to nearly a 50% increase with the Randolph County children that had been served. Outside of work, he serves on the PTO board of his son's elementary school. He volunteers with several organizations in our local community and also serves on committees through the Western North Carolina Conference of the Methodist Church. Families in local community areas, he is also an ordained <coughs> excuse me, Methodist minister and is also found in our local churches on Sunday morning filling in for his fellow pastors. This past year, he and his wife also took on a new role as foster parents. He frequently looks for opportunities for self-improvement and no problem seeking guidance from others. He brings humor into the workplace while still focusing on the job that needs to be done. Folks, please join me in congratulating our 2021 Emerging Leader, Joshua Britton of Mount Shepherd Retreat Center. This is a surprise to see my family here. Um, so the, the first day I came into the office at Mount Shepherd, uh, we were in a uh, little bit of some financial problems. Uh, we got a letter from a law firm and I was too afraid to open it. So I talked to my assistant. I was like, why do we have a letter from a law firm? And she says, probably a collections letter. So I left it sitting on the edge of the desk um, all day long, letting it taunt me. And um, by the end of the day, I realized, you know, God's called me to this ministry at Mount Shepherd. Um, God's going to help us provide and uh, see us through it. And I opened that letter at the end of the day, and it was a $10,000 check um, from the estate of one of Randolph County's uh, generous people. Um, I heard um, the senior center speech, what other county would we want to be in? Randolph County has been so generous and kind uh, to Mount Shepherd and our ministry. Um, so uh, thank you to you all. Thank you to my wife, Erin, uh, my family, um, everybody who supported our ministry. Uh, God is continuing to bless us. We had 73% uh, more kids in camp last year than we did even before the pandemic. And um, I, I'm just really excited to see uh, what we do for this county and for the children in our county, uh, especially after COVID. Services like camp are so important. There needs to be spaces where children grow in self-confidence and we're uh, tried and true, proven place where kids leave uh, feeling better about themselves, feeling more confident in themselves, growing in skills. Um, so thank you all for your support of Mount Shepherd. Uh, thank you to my family. Uh, thank you.